Good evening lads, I am just going to quickly introduce this vlog because this evening we're about to put up the Christmas decks. Yes, yes I know, it is literally the 7th of November. So, no negativity, thank you. We're going to start it whenever we bloody well like. I also wanted to show you, before we get into the festivities downstairs, and um, I did like a little time lapse of us like building the tree, etc. I wanted to show you this sick beauty advent calendar from Boohoo. Doesn't it look incredible? It's humongous. And it is literally 25 days of all like beauty bits and pieces so that's so sick i did open the first one because i like to spoil things for myself i should have said spoiler alert but this is the first day so it says lip lava molten chocolate so we've got like a little wait i can actually smell it that's cool i'm not sure if i ever really like like chocolate um like lipsticks and stuff but we shall give it a go and see. We shall now get into the festivities. Look at her. Have you already gone in here? Bit of bling. Yeah. Look at all of this. Oh, bit of bling, yeah. This is our more? theme for the Christmas tree. I don't know. Yes, Maya would like some of the ball balls. This. I don't know why we still have this. It's one of those random things that you have. You made, made it, it, didn't you? No, I didn't make it. You, you bought she it. You bought it at a Christmas fair. Oh, she also that you school. made it. When I was in like middle school. Is it Maggie? And it's just like one of those keepsakes, isn't it, Maggie? Yes, yes. Hello, Maya. Yes, hello. Good morning, welcome back to another vlog. Uh, today is the, oh my god, where's my phone? Hang on, this was terribly started, wasn't it? Yes, yes I know. It is the, do you wanna tell me what the date is? Or are we just gonna stand here like imbeciles? It's the 19th of November. How are we all? I hope you're doing well. Um, I just thought we'd do a little lockdown vlog, you know, because I've got nothing else to do today, it's my day off, so. Why not come and have a chin work with you guys? The rail is overflowing with coats. I think I might do a giveaway over my Instagram when I hit 50k. And I think I might just have to do like some sort of like coat raffle or like coat giveaway and just give away one of my coats because I have one body. <laughs> I do not need over 10 coats for one body. <laughs> to be fair, my sister and my mum, they do like borrow them. So it's not just me that wears them. So it it is, pretty ridiculous that I have over 10 coats. However, it's not just me that wears them. So it's kind of okay. So today I have been filming reels and I've been doing 
all sorts like that. I have really high expectations with my reels, so I will film a really complicated one and expect it to be like done in like five minutes. And then I'm like an hour down and I'm like, I haven't even started my first reel yet and it's 12 o'clock, I'm such a loser. No, no Abby just make simpler reels because people want to see your style. People want to see you. However, I just love doing like dancing TikToks and I love just making a mess out of myself. So there is a fun one coming on the grid soon. If it's not already, go and check it out. I have two others. Have I styled two? What have I even done this morning? I think I've got three. I think I filmed three. Um, content wise like photos I don't really need to get any at the minute because I stocked up well before lockdown so I've only been taking the odd one or two or three just to sort of like mix it up because otherwise I've just got outdoor oh god I'm choking on my words I'm getting so emotional I just mix it up a little bit so it's not just out all outdoor shots now that we're in lockdown like I like to sort of be like oh look here's me inside as well as here's me outside because you might get a little bit jealous that I'm outside you know even though I'm not outside I also changed my necklace over oh don't you worry the moon necklace is still here I just changed it because I wanted to change I don't really tend to wear gold jewelry you can see here and I did have a bracelet on as well and all my earrings are silver I got this cute one from it's called Anna Lee London and it's a cute little A and I love this sort of necklace because it's got like the beads on if you can see so she's cute and A just reminds me of Pretty Little Liars and although it makes me happy it also annoys me because I'm then like reminded of the shit ending of Pretty Little Liars if you haven't watched it definitely go and check it out oh oh might be a package for me Hang um I don't have a clue what this is Shall we open it up together? Because parcel force. So I kind of think I know what it is, but also it might not be the thing that I think it is. <laughs> Makes sense, yes, I know. Oh, that's really good. Oh, they smell amazing. Look at these. They're so pretty. Oh my fucking God. Look how freaking cute that is. It's got even a little white. I know who this is from as well. And I don't know if I can reveal. Oh, here. Come. Come out. Come on. Out. Come out. I don't know if I'm ready for this. I don't know. <gasps> it's even, look, a little Abby. <sighs> Welcome to the Primark Collective. We're so excited to be working with you. We've loved Primark and Power. <sighs> this is literally my dream come true. <laughs> I don't know if that's really freaking sad, but when I was a teenager, this was all that I would like where Primark has been one of those sort of brands that have been with me since I was a teenager like I would go into Primark with my mum with my family and we'd do like a little Primark call and we'd go and buy stuff like the memories lads the memories and to think now I'm now working with them this is the sickest thing in the entire world And I've said to my family, oh, when I when I work with ex-brands, like, 
when I've worked with New Look, Primark and body shops up there also. Then I'm a proper blogger, then I've made it, and I've done it. <laughs> I'm gonna get emotional, I need to stop. <laughs> so there is a YouTube video going up at some point in the near future which I am very excited about. I've done a video on this before, but that was way back in like the beginning of Abby, of mid-sized gal, of Abby's blog. If you were here when it was Abby's blog, you've been here a long time. I have done one, however, I'm doing an updated version because that is still getting huge amount of views. So I was like, you know what? I would be an imbecile not to do another one. So that'll be up soon. I'm having my cup of tea in my doing it for the gram mug that me and Jamie bought together in B&M. Throwback when you could see your friends. <sighs> mm. My tea's a bit lukewarm. I'm not gonna lie, I'm not, I'm not vibing with it. Hello, it's a little bit in the evening now. No, it's not. It's like three o'clock, I think. The sun is starting to set and she's looking marvellous. Um, I want to quickly pop on and show you one of the new sets that I got from Gymshark. So they had a Black Friday sale last week. I think they were earlier and I copped, I copped some. So I've got this, they're in the Flex set. So this is one. Oh, they're inside out, hang on. So this is one of the first sets that I got. It says Gymshark, it's like this grey... Is it marl grey? And it's got this cute, lovely sort of like pink um, print. Oh, Gymshark, Gymshark. I love the Flex stuff. And I tried it on just on my stories now. I'll save them and like pop them on here for you. But they um, are so flattering around the bum. So, so flattering. I need to adjust this one because it's a lot higher than what the other one was. But I really like this one. I also got a black set. I only got two sets because although they have a sale, lads, still quite spenny. All right? Still quite spenny. So we got two sets. <laughs> is the other set. I get them all in a size medium and I feel like even th these are quite like stretched already whereas the other ones were quite sort of like fitted. These were quite loose but I really like these. It's also got the Gymshark on the back. Oh and the bra's got Gymshark on the back also if you can see that and yeah I really like the um, bras on these because they've got adjustable straps so as I was saying in my Instagram stories, if you've got slightly bigger like boobays, you can like readjust them, but so, so nice. This is like medium, I think it was like medium support or something like that, or maybe it was even low support, but I highly rated it, I'm not going to lie to you. 